More committees have held their inaugural meeting as members pledged their commitment to ensure proper oversight on MDAs under their supervision. The committee chairman read out the discharge at their meeting with members who concurred to the resolutions. Plus TV Manuel Lihegene completes the report. Of financial crimes, the police, army, firma, and the delegated legislation. They avowed to ensure proper oversight function on all the ministries, departments, agencies, and parastatals under their supervision. Chairman of the House Committee on Financial Crimes, Honorable Ginger Obinna and his members vowed to stamp out terrorism, financing, and money laundering out of the country. The committee in preparation for commencement of activities will operate on the following jurisdiction. There shall be a committee of financial crime consisting of not more than 40 members constituted at the commencement of the life of the House. The committee's jurisdiction shall cover oversight of Economic Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, stroke, NFIU. In a similar vein, the chairman of House Committees on Army and the Police, in their inaugural speeches, pledged to tackle insecurity facing the country, as they called on members to support the four-year plan of the committee. Let me remind you that the leadership of the committee will do more on your ones of experience, expertise, hard work, and dedication in order to discharge function of the committee by ensuring adequate funding for agencies under our jurisdiction, providing, using legislation, carrying out performance audit and other allied oversight function, great towards efficient service delivery and responding to the national internal security architecture. The committee members on FIRMA and that of the delegated legislation share some of their resolutions. Subsidiary legislation often governs critical areas such as health and safety standards, environmental protections, financial regulations, and consumer rights. The laws can directly affect the well-being and livelihood of millions of Nigerians. Therefore, it is incumbent on us all to ensure that these laws are made with utmost care, ensuring that the interests of our citizens are prioritized and protected. We will use instrument of effective legislation, oversight, partnership, knowledge sharing, collaboration, and adherence to best global practices to revitalize, reposition, re-engineer, and rebat FEMA, ushering in a new era of improved road maintenance and efficiency for Nigeria as a nation. The committee members pledge to support their chairman to ensure that the renewed hope agenda of President Bola Ahmed Tinubu meets the yearnings of Nigerians. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.